Hey Guitar World, this is Steve Wilmet. I'm going to talk about my arrangement of dueling banjos. Uh, for this particular version of the song, I use three guitars. A five string, a six string, and a seven string. A five string guitar, what's that? Um, actually, I wanted to make one of the guitars sound as much like a banjo as I could. So I took my Les Paul and I took the uh, fifth and the sixth strings off altogether. Replaced the fifth string with a high E string tuned all the way up to G, sort of like uh, the first uh, string tuned all the way to the third fret. Um, I dropped the first string down all the way to D, so a full step down, and it gave me an open G tuning like a banjo. Except the difference on that is that on a banjo, this, the high string, or the first, uh, the fifth string is, is really high. Um, then I used a capo on the second fret because the original song was in the key of A. And it gets you this. <laughs> So it sounds like a banjo. Um, for the solo, I also used a Hartman um, octave fuzz pedal, which is like a Ty uh, Tycho Bray Octavia clone. And what that does is it gives you um, an octave note above the note you're playing. And it makes some really interesting um, ring modulator effects. So you'll hear that in the song. The second guitar I used was the main left channel guitar, and that was a Jeff Loomis uh, Schechter 7 string. Thanks, Jeff. Um, great guitar. Allowed me to get all the way down to a low A and uh, still maintain access as high as a regular guitar all the way up to the 24th fret. So that was fantastic for uh, getting a modern sound on the one channel. And the final guitar I used was for the Wah solo at the end, and it was just uh, um, my Les Paul Custom. And it was tuned standard, and I used uh, just a Dunlop Wah pedal. And uh, that's pretty much the guitars I used. Uh, for amps, I used a Mesa Dual Rectifier with the 7-string to get uh, a heavy modern sound. And then I used a Marshall Plexi PA head from, I think it's 67, with the Les Paul to uh, get sort of a more classic sound. And uh, that's pretty much it, except for the fact that I did use a delay. I used a dotted eighth note delay on the main banjo guitar to double the uh, speed of the guitar. So it's a lot harder to play on Guitar Hero than it is uh, on a real guitar. So I hope you enjoy the arrangement and thanks so much.